What's going on you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Wanted to just hop along and just record another series and I just want to cover like five things in my personal opinion that I think are lacking in Unturned Console Edition. Uh, just a little disclaimer, I'm not here to bash on the game. I think the game is phenomenal and I'm so happy that they officially released it on console. Honestly, I've been waiting for this game since like 2016, but it's finally here and I'm very, very happy that it finally came out. So, and I'm making this video for somebody who's currently deciding on whether you should buy this game or not so before hopefully before you do buy the game you kind of see this video and that way you still have an idea nothing ever is perfect in this world so it's not as bad as daisy so just want to throw this out there like it needs some work and hopefully nelson 505 games or fun labs hopefully one of you guys sees this video i'm sure it's unlikely unless you guys blow this up just saying but anyways let's just get through the list and get this over with because i'm currently starving so group system so especially on pc when you play multiplayer you're able to access a locker or a specific crate or even a metal door choose your group of people that you trust who can access the lockers crates metal doors because as far as the console edition right now all your teammates have to make separate doors to be able to get inside which is kind of weird number two search menu if you do decide to play this game by yourself and just want to have some fun on the server there's no search bar so when you access the cheat mode you can't search for a specific item you have to go through the whole list of items to find the one that you're looking for personally like if they at least had pictures by the names it would have been somewhat easier and less time consuming but with the search bar just like it is on pc it's so much easier so i'm sure they will implement this at some point down in the future but for now we just have to deal without searching and time is the currency we don't have so or we can't buy or replace so yeah unturned come on or five of five games number three is the most frustrating it's loot dropping so let's say you have an x amount of items in your storage to put them in the crate you have to split them up individually one by one so even if you have like four planks you have to split them up you have to drop three on the ground and the one you have currently you have to put in the crate and then pick one from the ground, put it in the crate, and that's how you have to repeat the whole process. It's so bad, and if I could just pick one thing for them to fix, just for now, because I know, you know, they're busy with everything, so I would say this is a crucial one. So imagine if you're carrying 76 tomatoes that needs to go in the crate. Like, obviously, you can't put 76 tomatoes in one crate, but, like, even if you had, like, five crates and you have to split them up, like, you still have to split them up to put them in there. And 76 tomatoes drop individually 76 times on the ground it just it hurts my brain as we speak so so number four would be the lag so this is something that can be improved on over time but it's not as bad but like it's still like every time i play with my friends online it doesn't matter what server i'm on us west canada whatever it's as if i'm watching back to the future movie one more time it's like they teleport they don't even drive so <laughs> It, it is what it is. It does not matter on what server you're playing on if you're playing on multiplayer. Thank God when you play with those people, you don't feel like you're teleporting, but to them you are. If they could fix this, that would be very impressive. I'm not gonna lie. This would be a huge game changer, honestly. Number five would be single player does not save. So every time you play single player, you just create a server, you play offline. It does not save. It doesn't. Whatever you build on that server, every time you leave the game, it does not save. They just recently fixed the bug where you're able to set passwords on your servers and it's they released that update maybe like three, four days ago. So it used to be that, you know, you put a password on your server, like it doesn't work. People can easily just click on the server and just join randomly. As of right now, it seems like they're just working on like the server basics, make sure everyone can see your server on the map, you know, stuff like that. But I do think they're at some point they're gonna hop in the game and just fix the glitches or hopefully sometime soon. But this is gonna be pretty much my list. I just wanted to make this for somebody who's still currently thinking about purchasing this game on console. I just wanna let you know that this game is not perfect. You're gonna have to bear with a couple updates. Mm -hmm.